Shifting focus, robots are a common sight on the industrial production lines, but now they are also increasingly in demand in the agricultural sector. Our next report tells you how an Israeli startup is offering a set of flying robots that can identify ripe fruit and harvest them. Take a look. Meet the fruit pickers of tomorrow. An Israeli startup is replacing farmhands with flying robots who do the picking themselves. It's a futuristic sight, an orchard bursting with fruit. And the buzz of flying robots rather than birdsong filling the air. The robots fly around and pick fruit straight off the trees, depositing them in a bin. According to Israeli startup Tevel, that makes life easier for farmers. It helps them in reducing food prices. The work becomes more cost effective. Our flying autonomous robots, we call it FAR, uh, they are small, agile and cost effective uh, robots. They fly, they equip with a gentle gripper that holds very gently the fruit. Uh, with no bruising. They have uh, four motors and driven by control algorithms that enable access uh, every fruit of the tree and gently take the, the, the fruit from the tree and place it in the, in the bin or in the platform uh, down. But you must be wondering how does the drone know which fruit to pick and which ones to leave? Well, they are driven by sophisticated software machine vision. Data streaming comes from surrounding 3D cameras in the system that are installed in the robots. Then the drones consume a lot of information, like what is the fruit, what is the foliage, how to access the fruit, if it is ripe, not ripe, what to do with the fruit and more decisions. After collecting all of this data within a matter of seconds, the algorithm helps the drone to make quick and accurate decisions. I think it's, it's, it's not in the near future which, where it's going to be robust enough, but it is a great idea that it's scalable and if you can make the robots robust and um, cheap, then you can definitely do some of, the, some of the picking using these aerial robots. Artificial intelligence is definitely um, the future and it's actually the present. We, we've been seeing it in, in academia, we've been seeing it for, for many years of, of using satellite imaging and also drone imaging to actually make um, intelligent decisions. And also we can see it now going more and more into investment into many startups working on artificial, artificial intelligence. The robots are already paired with farmers in orchards in Italy and the US and are making life easier for so many farmers. Well, don't be scared. These robots are not the end of the world. They are here to just help us and not replace us. Bureau Report, we own. World is one. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.